Hey guys, it's Phoenix. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome to new game mode extravaganza. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> oh my gosh, got a little TDM for you on Warhawk today. We'll let this play in the background, but do you ever get the feeling that Call of Duty is 10 pounds of stuff in a five pound bag? You thought I was going to say poop, didn't you? <laughs> Well, I get that feeling a lot. It seems like they're trying to add too much. They're trying to get too fancy year after year. They keep adding more stuff. It just... I don't know. It just complicates things. It, they find new ways every year to add in irritating crap. If they just went back to basics... What is this? Quick scoping's not in the game, right? Check this out. No quick scoping in Call of Duty Ghosts. Oh! Oh! Well, let's add some new game modes. Maybe we'll... We'll forget about the quick scoping thing. We don't need to focus on that. Let's put our entire development team into creating 8,000 new game modes to play every year that nobody ever plays because everyone plays Team Deathmatch. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm playing on the Xbox One, guys, and the player count on a good night is 40,000. Which gets my head scratching because Okay, there's like 3 million Xbox Ones out there and there's like 40,000 people on a night playing Call of Duty. Who is shooting me around this truck? Oh, pre-firing. Pre-fire that honey badger. So there's 40,000 people out of 3 million playing this game, which is kind of pathetic. But then to make the matters worse, you've got... A crazy amount of game modes I counted 13 I wrote all these down here I'm gonna run through them real quick okay we've got you know the standard stuff team deathmatch domination and then you've got search and destroy search and rescue which is different with the tags that they added in for this year cranked free-for-all team tactical kill confirmed infected Blitz, Hunted, Ground War on the Xbox One and PS4 only, and now they've added Heavy Duty mode to increase players' health because people are upset that you die too quickly in Ghosts. So all in all, you've got like 13 game modes and there's 40,000 people online. And uh, last night there was roughly 10,000. Oh! pick up a two-piece 40,000 online there was about 10,000 in team deathmatch and then the rest was kind of divvied up in those other 12 game modes I just mentioned I mean when connection this game is all about connection if the connection is crap you're not gonna have a good time you're gonna be lagging all over the place getting shot around corners it doesn't matter what game mode it is if you're if the connections crap you're not gonna want to play it so what does Infinity War do? They add all these game modes to spread everybody out. So I'm playing with somebody in Australia and Japan. Well, probably not because they're all playing the PS4. And I'm sitting here in the Midwest getting a crappy ass connection. Well, that just doesn't make any sense. You know, I, the game modes are good. I actually tried Blitz last night for the first time and I was surprised. It was awesome. If you guys haven't tried it yet, there's like 400 people on the playlist. So I was like, whatever, the connection is going to be terrible. It actually wasn't too bad, but there was some crazy stuff going on. But the game itself was actually pretty cool. It's team-based objective, and there's a portal on each side, and you basically have to defend your portal, keep your enemies from running into your portal and scoring a point, while at the same time defending your portal, you have to try to get to the enemy portal and run in, and it's awesome. You just run or you can slide into it, and then you warp back to yours, and you'll score a point for the enemy team. I was actually impressed. It's just, I don't know, the community's kind of ruined that mode too. I mean, there's, you can call it defending the portal, but I call it camping to pad your kill-to-death ratio is basically what that game mode was. There's a few people rushing, but I was rushing with an SMG like a boss. It's a lot of fun. Let me know if you guys want me to upload some of that Blitz gameplay. I'll definitely let you take a little look-see at it. I wouldn't mind playing it again. Alright, we're getting close to that sentry gun. There's the Chris Smooth dumpster. That'll come into play in just a moment. Stay tuned. 
Oh, get fence bang, son. And doggy tea bagged. All right, we'll get this sentry gun set up here. Got my puppy watching my back. I know they're coming from this way. I can just feel it in me bones. Oh, yep, there's a skull. Skull means they're coming. Oh, Griffin available. All right, check this out. Textbook dumpster diving. Crawl into that crisp smooth dumpster. <laughs> Let it fly. Check this out. Splash. <laughs> Redneck auto tune. Oh, look at that Griffin beast. I bet that's the first triple kill laying in a dumpster you've ever seen. <laughs> Oh man, I was laughing so hard last night when I did that. Oh, this game is good for unexpected random crap, isn't it? That's why we love it. That's why we play it. 75 to 43. You know if Infinity Ward wants to add something that's decent, how about a no sniper playlist? I'll be all for that. No snipers allowed. Now that would be worth playing. Listen up, Infinity Ward. Save your game 23 to 5. Hope you enjoyed the textbook dumpster dive. And until next time, work hard, play hard. This is Phoenix, and I'm Audi.